Suzuki launches 2022 Hayabusa in Philippine market. In a virtual event held last Saturday, June 26, 2021, Suzuki Motorcycles Philippines officially launched the 2022 Suzuki Hayabusa in the local market. The new and improved Peregrine Falcon has been sweeping the global market, and has garnered generally positive feedback thanks to a host of updates which bring it up to spec to the modern day. Prior to the introduction of the 2022 Busa, the sport bike already had quite the following in the Philippines. That said, let's take a look at what we can expect from the new bike. Starting off with the engine, we find a very similar mill as that of the previous bike in the form of a 1340cc inline four-cylinder motor. It pumps out a rather healthy 188 horsepower by way of fuel injection, dual overhead cams, and four valves per cylinder. Suzuki's engineers went to work in tweaking this decades-old engine in order to meet Euro 5 emission standards. As a result, it's down a few ponies versus the old engine which churned our 197 horsepower. While the previous generation Hayabusa was, for the most part, a very analog machine, the 2022 Hayabusa now comes with loads of tech features which bring it up to par with its modern-day stablemates. For starters, we now find a six-axis inertial measurement unit IMU, which governs electronic rider aids such as traction control, cornering ABS, and even wheelie control. Three preset riding modes and three customizable settings are on tap via Suzuki's drive mode selector Alpha SDMSA. Particular to the Philippine market, the new Hayabusa commands quite a premium. Retailing for 1,088,000 Philippine pesos, are the equivalent of $22,700 USD, the Hayabusa is one of the most expensive bikes in Suzuki's local lineup, following closely behind the GSX-R 1000 R nonetheless, given how loved the Hayabusa has been, it wouldn't be surprising if we begin to see the newest model of this iconic machine hitting the streets in the coming days.